good YouTube already knows face things here back at again with another video and today video guys I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get an animated flip book on reshade since a lot of people have been asking me how to do it and here I am bringing you guys a tutorial so all you guys want to do to install this is join my discord first in the description once you guys join you guys want to head over to crosshairs as of right now there's only two animated flip books there are going to be more in the future so right now I'm just going to install this one over here so I'm going to open it up right click on it save image and then just save it from there and go to your file folder at the bottom go to downloads and I drag this to your desktop once that is done you guys can minimize your discord and then you guys want to head over to this PC and locate wherever your GTA 5 installed on so mine installed my G drive I'm gonna press on that go to GTA 5 reshade shaders textures and then you guys want to scroll down till you guys find a way out so it's still gonna be listed over here it's kind of a weird name just press on this right click on it show more options rename and copy this name control C once you guys do that you guys can go ahead and delete this file over here so I'm gonna delete it from there on you guys want to right click on the new one on your desktop and you guys want to rename it to we out just like the old one so i'm gonna paste it enter from there on you guys want to drag this in here and just drop it from there on you guys can open up your 5m all right once you guys are in the server all you guys want to do is press home on your keyboard once you guys press home, it'll show up this menu. In order to enable the animated flip books, you guys will need this menu. So to download Reshade, there will be a separate link in the description. Make sure you guys go watch that video if you guys want to enable the animated flip books. Now for the people who already got Reshade and did all the steps, I want to know how to enable it. All you guys are gonna type in this flip book at the search bar. Then you guys will see the second one over here. Enable that. Now it will look like this. Now there's some settings you gotta adjust at the bottom over here at flip book. Let me just close these parts over here. Now this is gonna be everything for the flip book over here. So all the things I'm putting, make sure you guys copy. I'm gonna zoom in for y'all so you guys can see. Pause the video once I'm done. As you can see, it's looking a lot more better already. So everything's gonna be perfect. And this needs to be a thousand, a thousand. Make sure this is on 4, 3, 10. Make sure you guys copy all of this over here too. From there on, it'll look like this at the bottom right, which just looks super cool. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to replace it with the other ones if you guys wanna change it. So let's get right into that. All right, to replace the animated flipbook is super easy. So all you're gonna have to do is download the new one. So I'll download this one over here since there are only two right now. I'm gonna save it. Then go to my file folder at the bottom, go to downloads, drag this to the desktop, go to this PC. Now locate where your GTA 5 installed on, like I said before. So I'm gonna install my D drive, I'm gonna go there, I'm gonna go to GTA 5, reshade shaders, textures, right click on the way out at the bottom, control C so you guys can copy this name, and then you guys can delete this file. From there on, rename it to the exact same name as the old file. So I'm gonna just paste this in here, enter, drag and drop. Easy as that. Now you guys can open up your 5M. All right, once you guys are in 5M, you guys will realize the flip book at the bottom right is adjusted to the right size as a previous one. You guys can press home, and then if you guys wanna make it a little bit more bigger, it's gonna be this one over here. You guys wanna just adjust this. You guys can make it how big you guys want. Um, usually you guys wanna always keep it small because it's gonna cover up most of the screen. You guys don't want to have it super super big so i'll just probably stick with 199 that's my favorite one 0 0.199 it's a perfect size well then guys that's all i want to show you guys if you guys are new to my channel make sure you guys hit that thumbs up and subscribe hope you guys enjoy the video peace